Who said it was easy work? Who said it was easy work? Who said it was easy? Who said it was easy? Who said it was easy work? Somebody must do it, so I gotta do it. Who said it was easy work? Take back control of your mind. Stop walking around like a fucking zombie, drinking coffee every fucking morning because you're addicted. Stop drinking oil and processed sugar, Coca-Cola, Pepsi. Why are you doing this to yourself? You're a drug addict. That's really what it is. Y'all be out here making fun of crackheads. You are a crackhead, bro. Do you know that sugar has the very same effect on the brain as cocaine? So if you're eating Snicker bars, you're a crackhead. This is scientifically proven, whether you like it or not. You're eating cotton candy, you're definitely a triple crackhead, bro. You're drinking Pepsi, Coca-Cola, you're a crackhead. It's the reason why you can't stop drinking it. What do you think happened instead of a person's brain that's consuming drugs? What do you think happened? It's the constant release of dopamine, 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 that pleasure. And what do we know about dopamine? Dopamine is the molecule of more which means that you can never get enough. The more you consume it, the more dopamine releases, the more dopamine wants more dopamine. Dopamine, that's why they call it crack dope. You didn't even know that, did you? So yes, if you consume processed sugar, you are a crackhead. If you give your children processed sugar, they are little crackheads running around in your house right now because y'all don't even know how to raise kids these days. Tablet, tablet, tablet. Staring in the fucking screen with the blue light damaging the retina cells out of their eyes. But you claim that you're a parent. You know why? Because you're lost and you're drugged out and all you do is turn the TV on to go watch the news You believe everything them niggas tell you on the news. It's modified bullshit information Yo, 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 what up YouTube? Welcome to CN Take, man. My name is Jay CN. Coming back with another one, man. Y'all already know, man. I'm back out here, you know, on this, uh you know what I'm saying? Beautiful afternoon. The sun is up. It rained a little earlier, but man, it definitely don't look like it. You know what I'm saying? Because C block is dry as heck. You know what I'm saying? So we back on C block, man. Just chilling. You know, but real quick though, man, I had to show y'all that message from uh Fari76 or whatever. I think it was like 76. I don't know, but either way, man, uh go look at this tag and follow him on uh tiktok man because he's spitting that truth i think he on instagram as well man because listen at the end of the day we just got to be more conscious of it man we have to go back to nature in all ways bro we have to go back to, back to nature in general with our spirits you know with our you know food intake with the way that we think you know what i'm saying all of that we just got to go back into nature man because nature is where the healing is at. Nature is where the true dopamine is at. Not in all of this fake shit that we putting in our mind and our bodies. You know what I'm saying? Pornography, we know that that's fake shit. You know what I'm saying? This food out here, processed sugars, we know that that's fake shit. So, you know, the more that we put that in our body, the more addicted we come, we become. The more that we manipulate these dopamine receptors that we have and damage those. You know what I'm saying? That's what we do, bro. And a lot of people just don't get, you know, the the correlation of both, you know, food, pornography, pleasure in general. They don't understand. You know, they don't understand that, bro. Like when, when, when you turn your back on nature and you start, you know, indulging in all of this man-made stuff that they putting out here, you know, all of these frequencies that they putting out here, all of this fake stuff that they putting out here, bro. Listen, man, you know, that's when your body going to start to break down. That's when your mind going to start to break down. That's when your spirit's going to start to break down. Everything about you breaks down the more that you indulge into the fake stuff. The more that you indulge into this man-made stuff and you continue to turn your back on nature. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people will want to argue, well, you know, fruit and all this other stuff that got sugar in it. Listen, bro, we got to watch these fruits, too. You know what I'm saying? Because it's actually still real fruits out here, but they starting to manipulate that because a lot of people are going plant based. A lot of people are going back to nature or trying to. You know what I mean? And change their way of eating and change their lifestyle. So you got people like Bill Gates out here buying up all this farmland. You know what I mean? You got people like Elon Musk out here trying to put chips in your brain. You know what I'm saying? And what a lot of people don't realize, even going into this pornography shit, bro, you know, at some point with AI kicking in and the technology getting crazy, listen, bro, 
at some point they gonna have it to where motherfuckers got on headsets got on fucking you know what i'm saying them, them fucking vr fucking you know glasses and shit that you can see where they gonna make porn like a real experience so you're gonna have motherfuckers strapping they self in and they really gonna think that they getting the real thing when it's really fake you know what i'm saying when it's really fake they actually you know how movies well, you know, a lot of these movies people don't get when they put out, they telling the truth in them. So if you uh, ever go back and uh, watch Demolition Man with uh, Sandra Bullock, they had these things that they put on top of their heads. And that was the way that they had sex through, you know what I'm saying, through the visions and the things that they had in their head. So what you think that that chip that Elon Musk going to put in your head do? So you're going to have people subscribing to have virtual sex, digital sex. And not even be getting a real thing, but not even knowing that that chip is messing up their brain. Not even knowing that that chip might be causing cancer. Not even know that that chip is manipulating their cells and all of that shit, bro. But they put that in Demolition Man where they had, they, you know, Sandra Bullock and Sylvester Stallone to put on these headsets. And that's how, you know, they had sex in the future. So don't think that this technology this fake technology i mean it's real technology but you know the fake things that's getting put the man-made things that's getting put in this world don't think that it ain't coming because it's just gonna get worse and worse especially with ai people don't even know that they making ai porn ai digital you know what i'm saying women out here and this motherfucker's out here following you know what i mean they following these only fans following these you know digital ai creations and paying money to that when it's really like some nerd behind the damn the behind the damn uh you know internet behind the picture that's doing it probably some slob with glasses on you know what i'm saying that created that ai image and you fapping to that shit you know what i'm saying and you paying them that it's paying them your money and that ain't even the real thing just like porn bro you know what I'm saying? So this mug's actually taking it a level below porn. And, you know, now you pretty much fap into a, 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 a digital character, fap into a cartoon character, bro. You know what I'm saying? And not even knowing that you're just doing further damage to yourself. So we just got to be careful, you know, with what we're doing out here, what we're consuming out here, bro. You know, because as you can see, a lot of people turning away from nature and they not fig they, they they not figuring it out. They don't know why they had these addictions. They don't know why they can't stop chasing pleasure. They don't know why they having all these health problems. You know what I'm saying? And it's just going to continue until people wake up. You know what I'm saying? Until people really see what they trying to do. They destroying you, bro. They want to destroy you and they going to dress it up and make it look as pretty as they can, bro. You know what I mean? They gonna tell you, oh, you know, you ain't gotta worry about the fruit. It's seedless. But what they not telling you is that this seedless fruit ain't got no nutritional value. You know what I'm saying? And this, and that's the thing. That's what I was gonna get to telling y'all, bro. The 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 sugar and the 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 sugar, the natural sugar and fruit. Listen, bro. That's what you want. You know what I'm saying? That's not going that's not going to spike your insulin like this processed sugar will. Your body is going to take that glucose and actually utilize it because it has nutritional value. The, the 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 sugar that's being processed and made in these labs or that they putting in these in these GMO fruits, this genetically modified shit, bro. Like listen, dog. You know what I mean? All you doing is just getting the pure sugar from that. So you ain't getting none of the nutritional value you would get from the things that actually have the seeds in it, from the watermelon that actually have the seeds in it, from the oranges that actually have the seeds in it, from the apples and all of that, the grapes and all of that that have the seeds in it. So make sure you're getting the things that have the seeds because the seeds is the soul to this food, to the, the soul, to the fruit. Just like we need a soul, bro, everything natural has a seed. You know what I mean? From the trees, you know, you got the seed. They create the roots and all of that shit. But they trying to rip the roots out of everything. So you eating things that have no nutritional value that your body don't even know how to break down. Your body don't even know how to process. You know what I'm saying? So they doing it with everything. They doing it with the food. They doing it with porn. They doing it with social media. And they just want to continue to control you. 
And that's what it is, bro. They controlling you with these addictions. You know what I'm saying? They controlling you. They controlling your mind. They controlling you with all of this shit that they putting out, bro. And that's all they want, bro. You go ahead and put that neural link in your head. They going to control you even more. You going to be a robot. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people don't realize that they addicted robots with, with how they lusting, how they chasing these women, how they fapping away their life force energy. All of these things that they putting in their body, this GMO meats, GMO fruits. They call themselves eating plant based, but you and eating beyond meat and all of that shit, bro. What you think you eating? You know what I'm saying? What you think you eating? You got you go get a beyond burger, beyond sausage, and you don't even know what you ingesting. You're not even reading the ingredients. Don't nobody want to read the ingredients and, and, and don't even care to what they putting in their body. Don't even care about the dyes that they putting on all of this candy and you know what I'm saying? The the the, the processed sugar that's, you know, making you want more and more. What a lot of people don't realize is, bro, when you eating all this processed sugar, dude, don't you feel yourself still hungry after you eat it? That's called addiction, bro. You ain't even hungry, bro. You addicted. You and that's what people don't realize, bro. You not even hungry. You just ate something. You know what I mean? That's not that wasn't real. That was manipulated. That was processed and it keeps you coming back for more because it's about the money. It's about the money and it's just like you said, bro. People don't realize that this sugar is more addictive than cocaine. Than cocaine. They did a study on it, bro, sugar. Why you think your kids be spazzing out? Why you think your kids can't stop moving? Why you think they can't stop jumping? Why you think they can't pay attention in class and your teacher trying to get you to send them to the doctor so they could drug them up and put them on all types of Adderall and pills? And motherfuckers falling for it. They don't want to go look in that kitchen. They don't want to change the way they thinking. They don't want to change the way they eat. They don't want to change the way they live. They don't want to change their lifestyle. They they in denial. They going to refuse to believe it. So guess what, bro? They going to throw their kids right under the bus and have them on medication. The kid can't even be they self. Soon as the kid start, you know, being who they are, soon as the kid, you know what I mean, doing natural things and, and, and expressing they self, they like, go ahead and give them that meds. Give them them, give them them, give them them pills. Give them the meds. He need to calm down. He being too real. And that's what they trying to do to us, bro. They want us to calm down. We being too real. So they going to keep trying to distract us. They going to keep throwing pussy in our face, money in our face, and things to chase. You know what I'm saying? Keep throwing fear in our face. All of that. Because you too real. They going to come up with any type of way to shut you down. And the people around you that's in denial too, they going to try their best to uh, shut you down too. They going to try their best to not support you. They going to try their best to just disregard everything that you say. Just everything that you say, they going to try to debunk. They're going to try to debunk everything about you. The way that you live because you're going back to nature. You know what I'm saying? And the people that's out here programmed, bro, they don't want to see it. You know what I mean? They don't want to see it. They don't want to believe it. You know what I'm saying? But they're going to believe it, though. They're going to be crying for help. You know what I mean? When they on them hospital beds, they're going to be crying for help. You know what I'm saying? When they fighting all these addictions because it's going to go from food to drugs. Drugs to food. When you don't got no drugs, you're going to go to the food. When you don't got no food, you're going to go to porn. When you don't got no porn, you're going to go to chasing women. You know what I mean? And when you don't got that, then guess what, bro? You're going to find other toxic things to do with your time, do with your life, do with your body, do with your soul. You know what I mean? But they don't want to see that. They don't want to talk about that. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I know old boy's message may come off a little cruel, a little hard. I know sometimes I can come off a little cruel, a little hard. But, you know, I just wanted to talk to y'all about it because it's real. You know what I mean? It ain't just about food. It's about everything that they trying to do to us, bruh. So we just got to continue to wake up and become more conscious of this shit. Otherwise, we're going to be going into the abyss. We're going to be going down the rabbit hole. And guess what, man? Ain't nothing there but death. 
Ain't nothing there but addiction. Ain't nothing there but demons. Ain't nothing there but loser type shit. Ain't nothing there but toxicity, acidic acid that we melting away in. And we can't allow that shit if we want to be prosperous. We can't allow that shit if we want the blessings. We can't allow that if we want to get closer to the most high, bruh. We can't. So we got to strip all this off and keep going forward and stay natural out here, all right? And that's my word, man. My name is JC and it's CNT. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace. Who said it was easy work? Who said it was easy work? Who said it was easy? Who said it was easy? Who said it was easy work? Somebody must do it, so I gotta do it. Who said it was easy work?